The Vampire Diaries is known for having some of the best love triangles in TV shows, but there were plenty of couples on the series that didn't get their due. I loved watching Elena, Damon, and Stefan as the central characters in the series for many years. Their romantic dynamic defined the plots and stories that the series focuses on. However, as the seasons progressed, I became even more interested in the supporting characters and seeing them get the storylines they deserved. This especially came through in their romantic relationships, which were always a defining aspect of the series. Premiering on The CW in 2009, The Vampire Diaries became a smash hit for the network. It incurred two spin-off shows, The Originals and Legacies. Though neither of the spin-offs achieved the popularity of the first show, they cemented The Vampire Diaries franchise as a beloved and popular IP for the network. The supernatural elements and fights between good and evil were essential to the drama and conflicts. However, it was the love stories that kept me coming back for more. Seeing my favorite couples break up made me understand the Vampire Diaries moments that made viewers quit the show. The Vampire Diaries completely wasted the chemistry between Caroline and Klaus. Their unexpected dynamic became one of the best parts of TVD. I knew from the first moment that Candace King, Caroline, and Joseph Morgan, Klaus shared the screen that they were meant to be. Klaus' character introduction is teased throughout season 2 as an unstoppable force that will bring death and destruction to Mystic Falls. While this did come to pass, I couldn't help falling in love with his character, and he soon developed into much more. Though Klaus' objective is to use Elena to break his curse, this brings him into proximity with Caroline, whom he is taken with. Despite seeing him as a villain, Caroline is drawn to him. Klaus and Caroline's dynamic grows, and the show references their chemistry many times before finally allowing them to form a budding relationship. However, the Vampire Diaries kept them apart for the entire time that Klaus was a recurring character on the show. Even though her attraction to him is obvious, and the characters use his affection for her to their advantage, Caroline refuses to admit that she has feelings for him. Additionally, the episodes that place Klaus and Caroline together are few and far between, as Klaus is always on a mission to gain more power. I'll never forgive the CW series for not following through on this relationship. After Klaus left the show, there was little chance they'd be together. The Vampire Diaries spin-off series, The Originals, capitalized on the popularity of Klaus as a character, but it failed to complete the romantic arc between him and Caroline. While I enjoyed watching Klaus in The Originals as he got his own show dedicated to his character, I never believed his chemistry with anyone other than Caroline. Just as they were softening to each other and letting their vulnerable sides show, Klaus left Mystic Falls, and Caroline was left alone as Tyler also left the show. However, Tyler was never as compelling a love interest as Klaus.